Well, video number four. Um, out here on the river, there's not much sign, but there never really is until you throw out some caster mounds and then all of a sudden you start snapping some beavers that have been traveling up and down through here. So uh, I got a 330 out on a place that uh, you guys may remember from last year. A little place that I caught my biggest beaver to date that I've been weighing. I don't know if it's really my biggest beaver to date. Um, and I'm about to put one more 330 out and just see. Um, but drag two drowning rods and two 330s down in here. I might bring some rat sets. I don't know. I don't really feel like messing with rats too much. When I'm going to get this last 330 out, I just want to do an introduction for the fourth video down here on the river. And actually, I'm going to do a bullhead fishing video where I fish this slough for some bullheads. Because an old timer told me they used to catch, come up to this spot, literally right here, and hammer them. So that'll be a future video, but stay tuned. We'll start checking tomorrow. It'll be Thursday. Um, and I'll let these soak for a week. I usually let all the spots soak for, soak for a week and then pull them and move on. So stay tuned. Well, what do you think, bud? We got a beaver. We got a beaver. Let's walk down and check it. Are you holding on? Yeah. I see a froggy. You see a froggy? Yeah, I just seen a froggy. You catch it. Are you good? Yeah. It's a little fishy too. Yeah. All right, look at that, Bubba. You see him? Yeah. Yeah. Probably a 20-25 pounder? Yeah. Yeah, can I go set you on lane? You hold the camera for me? Yeah. All right, so we gotta get this trap reset. That. We get that. All right, you ready? Getting down? Yeah. Going this way. Ugh. Boop. Right, here, hold the camera and watch me. Okay. Make sure I'm in that screen. Okay. It is. It is oh, yeah. Good. Look at that guy. Not a bad one, huh, Bubba? Yeah. Yeah. Look, there's a muskrat there. Where's a the muskrat? Right there. Is he swimming? Yeah. What a stinker. Are you pointing the camera at me? Yeah. Boy, I got him. I think we did pretty good. What do you think? It's a big old one, Steve. Yeah, there's that one. Look, he's got a big old bite taken out of his tail. You pointing the camera at me? Yeah. Yeah, we're only a 25, 30 pounder, right, Bubba? What do you think? Yeah. Yeah, knuckles? Bang. Yeah. All right, ready to get down. All right, you got to make sure you're holding this on me. Watch the screen. Okay. Got it? Yeah. Well, it might, it's a beaver. It's a beaver. You pointing it at me? Watch. We got two beavers. So far. Ugh. We just got two beavers. So far we got two. This one's not that big though. You pointing it at me? Yeah, that is small beaver. Somehow we're all wrapped up around this big old tree line. We got a BB one. We got a BB one and a big one. What on earth is going on here? You pointing it at me? Yeah. It's twenty-five, Daddy. What, buddy? It's twenty-five. Huh? It's twenty-five. Yeah. I know. Come on, that. Big old beaver. A big old beaver? Mm-hmm. We got two big beavers. See him? You point the camera? It looks like you're pointing the camera? It looks like you're camera at the ground. We got two bits. We got a, two big beavers. I got a big beaver, guys. I did tell them. You told them? Yeah. Did you, uh... I told you show them? Yeah. I just got a beaver right there. How to catch it for me? We got two big beavers. And I'm talking about we got two big beavers. I tell them got the two big beavers. Mm -hmm. I like one. We got a big, two big beavers. And we got Daddy call me. Yeah, he's right there. He's gonna be trip. 
Yes. Can you tell them? Yeah. Yeah, we got two big beavers now? Yeah. Well, that's number two. I don't know how well he's controlling the we camera, but... We're gonna go check number three and number four. You ready? Yeah. All right, walk that way. Well, I don't know if you can see him or not. I see the foot see right there. But this was a 750 right here. And uh, we are four for four on these traps. I just haven't shown anything, but I'll give the camera over here to the cameraman in a second. Uh, we are three beavers and one muskrat. Unfortunately, the muskrat plugged up the best 330 on the property, but apparently all the traps are pretty good proper, or pretty good trap sets on this property so far. So, you getting over here? It looks like. I gotta pull them in. You want to pull them in? Yeah. All right, hold on. Let me get this stuff off the ground. And then you can pull them in. All right, I'll hold the camera. Okay. All right, pull it. There you go. Pull that. Oh, I'll help you. you. I'll help you. Pull. Help me pull. Oh, see him? Yeah. Holy I see cow. Holy cow. Oh. I Look at that bat foot catch right there. Look at that. That's what it's supposed to do. I didn't catch them. You didn't catch them? Yeah. It's not a bad beaver, huh, Baba? I mean, knuckies? Good job pulling them in. You are the man. Here, you want to hold this for me? So I can get them out of the trap? Yeah. You're the best. I got pretty lucky, I guess, with the back foot catch on that one because I didn't know exactly. I mean, it's super shallow, but the channel comes up. I got the caster mount set that Bobo's playing with. Hey, don't play with that too much, buddy. Why? It's got scent stick and stuff in it. Good. There's the MB750 drowning rod. So uh, we're going to walk over, let the cameraman, he wants to pull in the muskrat. So, any knuckles on the beaver? Bang. All right, let's go over there. What's a muskrat? No stinky muskrat. And beaver. Got a muskrat. A little stinky butt, huh? That's a bad muskrat. You hear geese? Yeah. You hear me geese? Too. Yeah. That's one right there. You see them? Yeah. Here? That's the only one. That. Pull that. Yeah. Pull it. Hold That's on, me. I'll help you. You want help? That's a tree on it. Oh. There you go, pull. I almost fell, huh? Yeah. yeah, that wouldn't have been good, would it? Alright, we'll get him out of the trap. Can you show him off to everyone? That's why I'm sitting here. You got him? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, alright. We'll carry these bad boys out and then do a final catch for the day. Sort of little short outro for this little one. This is check number one on this spot. We're already doing way better than we have been most of the season. Stay tuned. All right, go. Try it. Try What are you doing? Come on. Oh, jeez. It's too heavy. It's too heavy? Yeah. I think so, too. Big beavers in there. Big old beavers in there. Check number two on the river down here for the site of our shop. And uh, we're going to see what we catch. But I'm saving about a 200-yard walk with the old skitty, so... Stay tuned. We'll see what we get. Well, that could have got bad. Um, drowning rod, luckily came up on land. I mean, deep back foot catch. But um, yeah, I, uh, I guess I'll dispatch and we'll reset. I don't know how he pulled that rebar out. It was in the ground about foot and a half, but I'm glad I came and checked him tonight. I will right, get back with you guys in a minute. Well, check number two, successful. Got us pretty nice beaver, as you've seen. 
um, somehow he had dragged my drowning rod up on land instead of drowning. Um, it is kind of shallow. Um, I've seen people say like three, four feet of water is fine. Hope it is because it's about three and a half, four feet of water and he yanked it up out of the ground somehow and got up on land. But meanwhile, that's beaver number four. And um, the whole time I've been here on two opposite ends of the world here, I've heard two tail splashes. So no, there's still at least one and I'm assuming two more beaver in here and uh, that would make five or six. So I uh, kind of expected better. I had a tripped, my MB750 was tripped and he was probably just muskrat as you see. They uh, tend to be all over the place down here. I just recorded one swimming down the river. Um, like everything otters beaver river muskrats they all travel the river so you just get a lot of game up and down through here but um we'll see uh fix the 330 reset the 750 hopefully i'm not making beavers trap shy i'm thinking it was a muskrat just climbed up on shore there smelt the caster and wanted to have at her so we're about to head out that yeah, was check number two here obviously not as good as yesterday but what you can expect to beat the hell out of them once you can't beat the hell out of them any time so stay tuned